Hi Capricorn, this is your weekly day-by-day -day tarot cards reading by Emma for the week beginning 5th of July 2021. I'm going to draw two cards per day for every day of this week. So Monday, the 5th of... <coughs> pardon me. So Monday, the 5th of July. Night of Wands. Tuesday. Four of Cups, Wednesday, Seven of Pentacles, Thursday, Five of Pentacles, Friday, Temperance, Saturday, Eight of Pentacles, and Sunday with Ten of Swords for your cap. The Wheel of Fortune, your influencing energy. All right, we're going to talk about it just now. So, Knight of Wands on Monday with King of Cups, Four of Cups Tuesday with Knight of Pentacles, Seven of Pentacles Wednesday with Ace of Wands, Five of Pentacles Thursday with Ten of Wands, Temperance Friday with the Fool, Eight of Pentacles Saturday with Two of Swords and Ten of Swords on Sunday with Six of Cups. The magician, many readings did have two majors that belong to this influencing energy, to this previous week, to this previous period, major arcana kind of from earlier on. Anyway, I'm just mentioning to you. <laughs> so two majors, majors for you as well, Cap, Capricorn, the Wheel of Fortune and the magician. Um, something that begins, okay, finishing, new cycle in your life. Old one is finishing, new one is beginning, and for certain ends, for sure. The magician energy is within you. This one is very confident. Whatever that is beginning, you expected it. You are prepared. Okay, you are ready for it. You kind of, you did your school or your homework. Okay, you've done your job and you are expecting, you've got everything available, everything needed just to move forward. Okay, this wheel is turning, a new phase in your life, and you are ready for that. You kind of anticipate it. You work towards that new phase in your life. Kind of you knew the thing supposed to change. You worked with that change and you already, somewhere last week, you felt very confident the things finally changed and you already, you are prepared. You can move on new things on your life, new idea, very optimistic. You're going to move forward like magic, like wind. Beautiful, you know, influencing energy from earlier on. In fact, that's how you came into this week. And now, Knight of Wands is lovely one. That is um, fire sign, okay? But I, I will really say that it is a situation that is a sudden, but it's very enthusiastic. And it's, I think it's about your career because a Knight of Wands is creator. That one creates the situation, though suddenly, though unexpectedly, surprisingly even. You see what I'm saying? That on Monday. But you will be quite all right with that. It's it's kind of whatever that is changing and uh, uh, with this Wheel of Fortune change of cycle. Now, this suddenness of the situation, exciting situation, it seems to me it doesn't interrupt you. Kind of you, yeah, you are expecting it. Like you are ready for it. That unexpected. Oh, you were ready for that. You know, no surprise for you. This King of Cups is not surprised, you know, it's cool customer, this is like diplomat, like you knew it's going to happen like that, or even if you didn't, you were ready for that situation. Nothing wrong with Knight of Wands situation, okay, even if it brings something that is unexpected and it seems misfortunate, you get fired from work. You know, let's say, I'm just giving you an example, don't, don't panic <laughs> immediately, let's say like that. You get fired from work. What it means is that something else you're supposed to going to work next month for that another company that will mean world for you, that business, that business, that career, that another company, that is, is a future for you. You see what I'm saying? That what is this Knight of Wands. Even if at first seems unfortunate or, or funny or strange, 
it means good, it will achieve your goals, your dreams, good results, you know, it's kind of kind of fiery, kind of constructive, kind of creative, very lovely, I kind of like that energy, even if it's kind of random sometimes and unpredictable, it can, it can um, kind of be, uh, can, can bring kind of stress on you, can it kind of play with your nerves, but I'm just saying what this one can do, but it doesn't do with you, okay? You are cool customer in here. You are emotionally stable, Capricorn. As I said, you expected it. I'm talking about this one just to, just to underline, just to confirm your steadiness, okay? Your understanding, your emotional stability here, whatever that comes, okay? You are expecting it. You are interrupted. You are solid. You see what I'm saying? Emotionally very stable on Monday, but I do like that sudden exciting situation that came on Monday. That is very lovely. You will be dealing with that perhaps you, like you expected it, all right? Knight of Pentacles, another night, but now this is within you. Perhaps that's what happened on Monday. It is your practical work that you see, that you can do. Nothing that interrupted you in here. And this is very solid, very slow moving one, very certain, very grounded. You are just moving slowly. Emotional stability, everything's cool. You are moving forward. That is your work that you're supposed to do. That is money that you're going to be receiving once you finish that work. That's what you know. That's your job that you do. You see what I'm saying? Very grounded. Slowly but surely, you'll get there. You'll get your money. You'll finish this job. Perfect. Capricornian energy. Very, very um, acceptable. Very suitable for Capricorn people. This Knight of Pentacles. Now, in your environment, something that is offered, okay? Is somebody offering to you or you are offering to another you, it might actually be that you are offering to another um maybe this partnership in this business let do things together okay we can share uh, profit or success could be something like that but this one is not gonna jump with excitement okay it's not going to be happy with this proposal, with this um, offer or something. Even if it's just offer of friendship or, or let's do things together, you know, just for fun. No, it's nothing that is uh, exciting for this person here. Maybe it's you, though I don't see you in this mood at all, okay? I really see you very confident here, Capricorn, not like this melancholic, not in that mood. So I believe it is somebody else who doesn't have a job right now or who is, I don't know, for some reason melancholic and you wanted to help, but person is still not reacting. Something like that. But you are good, you are moving forward towards your goals. That's it. Ace of Wands. Now this wand that this night held in its hand, that idea, that what came up on, I believe on Monday, will be strongly in your mind on Wednesday, you will go with that. You will see that you can invest and yield some results. That idea is about your investment, about how to do with your resources, how what to do with your knowledge, with your valuables, with your um, values within you, okay, as a person. I mean, knowledge, qualities, whatever qualities that you can put together, you know, as your investment, you can go with it out there and earn some money and show yourself as a quality person, as successful person or something, yield some results with it. Put together some money and invest. That is investment, idea about investment. Perhaps somebody came up with this idea about investment. Let's do this. You know, this is great investment to do that. You know, you will understand that idea is really good idea. You can invest, it will yield results. That is on, on, on um, Wednesday for you. You will understand good investment there on Wednesday that you found. Idea about it is, seems very, um, very attractive uh, to you. 
No, five of pentacles and ten of wands. No, this is a diff different and difficult kind of energy. Ten of wands is always difficult. There is burden that you are carrying. I mean, something that is about your money, you are lacking money for something. Maybe you invested everything, now you don't have every day's money or it's not enough to invest or you are left alone with something. Maybe you wanted to do partnership to put all your resources together, okay, and it will be perfect investment, okay, but now you, here you are left alone on your own devices, with your own investment, with your own stuff, whatever there is, feeling left alone, that's for sure with this five of pentacles, that's burden for you, that is burden, you don't know how to, how to, what to do with that right now, that kind of being on your own, dealing with situation, always on your own, kind of bothers you on this day, I really feel that is about it, that everything has to be done with your two hands, you have to organize everything, make money, do, organize your business, you see what I'm saying, whatever, whatever, many, many things put together, you always on your back, everything by your own two hands, okay, everything falls on your back, there's no help in here, no helping hands, somebody to say, okay, give me one wand, I'll help you, you see what I'm saying, you will, you will bring things to an end, you will definitely get out of that situation, you'll find solution, you'll drop this load, you are famous Capricorn, I mean, if somebody can carry this big load, you can carry big load, you can do big amount of work, you can complete big jobs you see what I'm saying it is perhaps on this day that you felt goodness it's a bit much you know it's always on me it's always by myself you see what I'm saying it is about work it is about making money I really felt like that this isn't your private life this is your work amount of work that you are carrying maybe amount of things that's not just work it's just things that you have to organize and do and bring to an end you see what I'm saying it's on you you will bring it to an, end, to an end, you will succeed, you'll drop these slots, that's for sure, you'll save yourself, you'll find solution, you, you don't, you do not belong here, you are not type of victim, you know, even if you feel like that on this day, it's not going to be for too long, I mean, you will be out of it, and look at this, full energy on Friday, immediately, on the next day, so that's what I said, you will drop this load eventually, maybe you haven't done it yet, and perhaps you haven't done it up until end of this week, you see what I'm saying, but it is, oppor not opportunity, but acknowledgement that you will, sooner or later, you'll finish it, you'll do it, you know, if you have help, if you did have help, it would be sooner, but if you don't have help, it will be later, but it will be, <laughs> that is, you know, inevitability with you, that's what you know, and you are optimistic, you do it, it's all right, it's not your first time, you'll complete your work, you do this planning, you'll put, you'll drop this load eventually, and optimistic, being very optimistic about what is after that, from now on, later on, your life is opening in here, that's your understanding, that's your feeling with this uh, uh, full energy, but that's temperance in your environment, which is very balanced energy, it seems to me that that's your understanding, okay, you are carrying something, and just to be patient around the corner, around the corner situation is changing and it's going to be better and it's opening different world different life for you okay just around corner just now just a little bit of extra time just a little bit more patience just a little bit more work you are very optimistic on this day this beautiful two majors on friday okay now Eight of Pentacles with Two of Swords. Eight of Pentacles is your work. You being diligent with something that your skill work. That's your knowledge. Even if you are learning, you are a student, okay? You are diligently learning. Nothing that can stop you. I mean, you don't even want to think about anything else, okay? It seems to me that acknowledgement on Friday, that feeling, oh, you know, that you will finish everything and your life is opening for you. Just a little bit longer, just a little bit extra, just just around the corner, you see what I'm saying, that is awareness, and that is actually optimism, and happiness, and enthusiasm about something that is coming, and you know for sure that is coming, so with these two of swords, you don't want to think about anything else, you are all immersed, and concentrated, 
in that work. That's what you're supposed to do. Yes, you will do. You will drop this load. That's what I said. This load, this mass of things that you're supposed to do. You know, perhaps on this day you felt a little bit left alone or disappointed or as a victim. But now, you know, you know that you will do it. You will complete this work. The Eight of Pentacles, you are working diligently. Nothing else matters, okay? You don't want to feel like a victim. You don't want to even allow yourself to feel or think anything about it. You do what you have to do. Simple as that on Saturday. You won't allow yourself to be, I don't know, disappointed or to feel alone or a victim. Or you see what I'm saying? You won't allow that sort of feelings to come up because it, that, that hurts, okay? That will hurt you. And that's why you are not allowing it. Even to think that it's too much, you needed help. On these days, perhaps again a lot. Okay, Saturday, you all working a lot on Saturday. But you won't allow yourself to, inter, to, to allow that feelings to come up, that unwanted feelings, whatever that you don't want to feel, you won't allow to break into your mind. You see what I'm saying? You don't want to feel melancholic or sad or left alone or abandoned. You know that you have to work, okay, on this day because it will mean beautiful future for you and it's not for much too long. You will drop this load soon. That is all about here. So you don't want to feel yourself as victim or, or so and so. Not the chance. What you have to do, you will do, and that's it. All about this Saturday. Now, Ten of Swords and Six of Cups, it seems it's going to be over. All right, you might actually drop this load by Sunday. Uh, maybe actually Saturday that you will perhaps put an effort and finish that job. Maybe something very practical, some project, something that you're supposed to finish. A deadline is there. Something is there that you have to finish and it's a lot. And it's on your shoulder. There's nobody to help you. You will complete it. By Saturday you will complete it and all your worries, all your troubles. You will be exhausted, okay? This is feeling like a dead meat, exhausted, totally, but it's finished, it's done, okay? New, new um, enthusiasm, that childlike enthusiasm is here within you, okay? And I really like it, I really feel, felt that this, this week there is a something practical that you have to do, you know how, you will do it, it's, it's much perhaps, or it's either Deadline is there. You have to finish by Saturday. And otherwise, this is job for three weeks. You see what I'm saying? Something is too much in here for you. And you will be doing it. You'll take this load. You take it bravely. You will complete by Saturday. Okay? You will have your ups and downs, emotional ups and downs. By Sunday, you are dead meat. You are exhausted. But it's over. You've done it brings this feeling, this pleasant feeling. You've done it. New life. This is childlike feeling with optimism, with happiness, with naivety, with, I don't know, things will be fine. You've done it. You deserve that. Whatever comes, you deserve. Kind of maybe some gratification, maybe compliments. You deserve that. You're complimenting yourself. You're happy with yourself. You see what I'm saying? That kind of inner child is working within you, very happy within you. Interesting week, Capricorn. You will manage. I mean, you can manage. Many people perhaps here on Thursday would fail. Many people would give up, but not you. You will succeed. You'll drop this load. By Sunday, oh, you're going to rest and relax. You recuperate. It's, it is over. You'll be fine. Enjoy it. And good luck. <laughs> anyway.